Hey guys, this is Debbie from DebbieStongalon.com and I know that some of you want to make a freebie or some sort of PDF that you can give to either your email subscribers or just readers on your blog and sometimes that can be a little complicated. So I'm going to show you the easiest way that I use to make PDFs on my blog. The first thing I do is use Word. So you want to open up Word and then I go into um, the files and I just open a blank file and I go into insert and I come down and I insert a picture and I made a picture in PicMonkey and I made an 8 by 10 picture but you can make a you know whatever picture size you want you just need it to be able to look good when it gets expanded in um, in in Word. So I'm gonna go find what I made which you're all gonna totally love and there it is. So there is my picture. Now I kind of want it to be bigger than this. So I'm going to go up to the top in these margins up here and I'm going to move them way over. And you can move all the way over to the side. I tend to just make them this way because it makes a border on it anyway. And then you can go down to the bottom and you can make the margins on the top and bottom better too. Then you're going to click on your picture and make it the size that you want. So you're going to click it so that you see this box and then you're going to open it up and drag it till it fits the whole picture. So you see this? It fits the whole picture. Now it looks like there's more space here so I could fix that by making this margin at the top a little lower. So now it's a little more centered. Okay, so there we go. Of course it's an awesome graphic and you're all going to want to download it, I know. Now what I do is I go up to file and I hit print and I'm not really going to print this. What I'm going to do instead is when I get this print screen here, I'm going to hit this button down here that says PDF, save as PDF. And what will happen is my computer will open and it will give me a day, a place to save this. So I'm going to save it on my desktop. I have a place where I save all my junk and I'm just going to name it awesome if I can spell awesome pdf dot pdf and then hit save it's processing guess what totally done that's it that's all you have to do so now you can save this if you want as a word document if you wanted to come back to it another time I usually on all my pdfs that I save for um, distribution on my blog I save them as a word file so if I need to come back and adjust them or do something to them I know exactly where they are but you don't have to but that's all there is to it so now I want you all to you know go find this PDF and download it and stick it up next to your computer because I am awesome okay have a super fantastic day and remember you can do this